Today we're opening K-Dog and Fish Boxing Day Mystery Boxes and battling my friend Patrick from Pops and Props. So let's go! Alright you guys, we've got two K-Dog and Fish Boxing Day Funko Mystery Boxes. There are two pops inside each of these boxes, and each box was only $20. Now most of the pops in these boxes are commons, but still two commons for 20 bucks is a killer deal, and they did mix in some exclusive and chase pops as well, so you never know what we're gonna pull. This mystery box challenge was issued to me from my friend Patrick over at Pops and Props. If you haven't already, make sure to check him out. Hey everyone, my name is Patrick, but I am better known as Pops and Props here on YouTube. On my channel, I love to do a bunch of Funko Pop content such as reviews, unboxings, and so much more. I also like to show you guys how I make my own prop replicas so you guys can do it yourselves. Today I will be battling it out against Spencer with two Boxing Day mystery boxes from K-Dog and Fish. So good luck to you Spencer and may the best box win. Oh Pat you're so nice now I feel bad I kind of taunted him in the video clip I sent him saying that I thought my boxes were gonna win but it's okay we're all friends here just having a friendly competition with some K-Dog and Fish mystery boxes. Let's go with box number one here we're gonna add up my totals as i go and see how we did on these all right i'm gonna open it this way so i can't see it oh they are paper wrapped okay and bubble wrapped guy i love k-dog and fish's packing job they're so good all right pop number one here we go we got sir mix a lot oh that's a cool one i usually don't get a lot of music pops so that's neat for something different okay we got all the bubble wrap off there which is great because it looks like this pop arrived in excellent shape this is a really cool one too. I have never seen one of these up close before. Oh, you guys, I just noticed the base on this pop too. Look what he's standing on. He does like them big and he cannot lie. This is a really funny pop. There are a couple paint flaws, but there usually are on Funko Pops. All in all, this one's not too bad. I love that his glasses are see-through, but they did tint them a little bit. So they do look like shades, which is pretty cool. And the detail on his ring is really good as well. That is all raised texture. So some nice detail on this one. All right, let's see what Sir Mix-a-Lot is sitting at on the Funko app. This is at $16. The box was 20 we've almost recouped all of our money just from one funko pop all right you guys and here we go with pop number two in our first box we got oh we got an exclusive yes this is the triple a anime exclusive superman so we're already doing really good we pulled an exclusive on our first box and these were supposed to be mostly common so i'm really happy with this one so there we go the triple a anime exclusive superman i'm not sure why a superman pop is an anime exclusive that makes no sense to me as an anime fan but honestly it's pretty cool the detail in his suit is my favorite part about this funko pop if you look really close it's actually all textured to look the way it does in the movies which is really really cool and i gotta say pretty crisp paint job on this one too the the emblem on his chest looks really good and I do love that it's an action pose where he's floating up in the air. I love Funkos with action poses. Okay let's see what Superman's sitting at on the Funko app. This is an exclusive so I bet we're gonna make our money back on this one. Yeah this one's sitting at $21 so this pop alone pays for the box. All right you guys so in box number one we got Sir Mix-a-Lot and the AAA anime exclusive Superman. These two come in at $37 on the Funko app. We paid $20 for the box so we're already way ahead. Okay can't wait to see what's in this one. Let's go. God I love opening K-Dog and Fish mystery boxes. It's so much fun. All right, pop number one from this box. We got Chucky. Oh, that's cool horror pop for something different. We don't open a lot of horror pops here, so this one's kind of cool. There we go. Oh, this one has got some really cool detail on it. Check it out, you guys. There is our Chucky. The paint job on this one is really, really nice. They did a great job blending some of the colors on his clothing. And the stitches are raised too, which gives it a bit of texture and depth, which is pretty cool. And the pose is pretty awesome as well, holding the axe. All in all, really cool Funko Pop. Let's see what it's worth on the app. Okay, Chucky is coming up at... $28, my gosh, this was only a $20 box. We're already eight bucks ahead and we still have another pop to open. Okay, pop number two, we're already massively ahead on the one on this $20 box. We pulled 28 already. We got, oh my gosh, a Funko Specialty Series? Are you kidding? We got a $28 common and now an exclusive in the same box? Oh, here we go. So this is Genshin from Tokyo Ghoul. Funko Specialty Series Limited Edition. Very nice. Now, I haven't actually watched Tokyo Ghoul yet. It is on my list, but this is a really cool looking pop. I love the detail on their sword. That looks really cool with the red accents. And I do like that their coat and tie appear to be blowing in the wind for a bit of an action pose. That is really cool. Okay, let's see what our Funko Specialty Series is worth on the Funko app. Scanning it now. It's only $16, but we're still way ahead on this box. All right, you guys, so we got our Funko Specialty Series that came up at $16 and our $28 Common Chucky. This box comes in at 
$44 value and I paid 20 bucks for it. We are way ahead on this. All right, you guys, so from these two K-Dog and Fish mystery boxes that I spent a grand total of 40 bucks on, we pulled $81 worth of value. Pat, I don't know how you did on your boxes, my friend, but I don't think there's any way I'm losing this battle. I pulled absolute fire from these. K-Dog and Fish said there were a few exclusives mixed in. I managed to pull two of them. Thank you, K-Dog and Fish. If you guys haven't already, check them out online, kdogandfish.com. They do awesome monthly mystery boxes. And now that you know my grand total, you gotta head over to Pops and Props on YouTube. We'll leave a link in the description down below. Watch his video and see if he beat me on these mystery boxes. But again, there's no way. I pulled double value. Oh, and by the way, even if I lose this battle, I have still won the war because I pulled the holographic chase K-Dog and Fish sticker in my order. Ooh, shiny. Well guys, I really hope you enjoyed unboxing these K-Dog and Fish Boxing Day mystery boxes. I had a ton of fun. Thanks again to Pat from Pops and Props YouTube for inviting me to do this challenge. Make sure you guys head on over, subscribe to his channel, check out his mystery box video. And make sure you're subscribed here as well at Combo Collectibles because we have some more mystery boxes, Funko Soda Chase Hunts, anime figure unboxings, and some awesome convention coverage coming up this year that you guys won't want to miss. But right now, I want to thank you so much for watching, and we'll see y'all next time.